hello everyone. I want to show off my new build in uh, Tiny Tina's Wonderlands, which I'm having a ton of fun with. And uh, it's a companion build. I picked uh, Graveborn and uh, Spore Warden as my two uh, classes. And uh, I'm not going to go into the skill points or the skill trees uh, that much, but the two main focuses uh, with this specific build is going to be the Faithful Thralls and uh, the Dark Hydra. So the cap for uh, the Faithful Thralls are uh, three, but with the class mod we're using, we are actually able to get four. And uh, this uh, actually makes the damage you deal uh, more for every companion you have out. So uh, you want to have as many companions out as possible all the time, basically. And this is the Dark Hydra one, which uh, is a kill skill. You have a chance to summon a Dark Hydra companion that deals uh, dark magic damage or dark magic ability damage. And uh, the cap here is uh, three, but with the armor or class mod we're using, we are actually able to get a maximum of uh, five, which is uh, going to be really good. So uh, for the weapons, we're going to have Ferior, which uh, when you reload them, you throw them away. And uh, you want to aim for the ones that gives you uh, Hydra on uh, reload. So this specific one doesn't have the text that shows uh, you to get a Hydra. <laughs> but uh, when you reload it, you actually get a Hydra. And this is uh, frost damage on uh, the weapons, so the Hydras will do uh, frost damage as well. That's how uh, the build is going to be uh, going. You want to reload and uh, throw out as many Hydras as possible. Uh, but you can actually get a different type of uh, rolls for, for these weapons. And uh, we have a shotgun here, which uh, obviously has uh, way more damage than the pistol. Uh, but this actually creates a uh, tree-headed Hydra instead of the single-headed Hydra. So uh, it's generally better if you can get this roll. Uh, the only downside with the shotguns are uh, the ammo. You don't have as much ammo on the shotguns. But if you can manage to get one of these pistols, this is the same one, but um, with pistol type instead. So this is the main weapons that I'm using at the moment. And uh, this is only for when I'm actually shooting, <laughs> not reloading. Uh, for my melee weapon, you want to try to have uh, this one. It spawns a uh, Hydra Companion when you attack with the uh, melee. So uh, the damage on those specific Hydras won't be as good as uh, the ones from your weapons. Uh, but the more Hydras, uh, the more damage you do, since uh, you have this one. And uh, for my ring, I'm using uh, as much companion um, damage or aspects that I can find. So for this one I have companion critical hit chance and companion critical hit damage. And uh, while the world is full, the effects are increased with 100%. For my second ring, I have uh, companion damage and companion critical hit chance. And it's the same uh, ward type here, so uh, while the world is full, my effects are increased with 100%. My shield here is uh, very interesting if you play uh, co-op with uh, another player that has one of these uh, rune shields because you share the actual ability. So this specific one increases your companion damage with 25%, which is huge. For my necklace, uh, we have when the Fate Maker or a companion kills an enemy, the companion damage is increased by 20% for 15 seconds. And the effect can stack up to five times. So that's huge. And the specific role here is uh, all damage dealt, but that can be uh, basically anything. And uh, for my um, spell, I'm using this specific one that has a uh, repeated cast and spawns a Hydra on impact. So I can create three Hydras with this one. But there are many different uh, companion spells that can make you uh, spawn uh, one Hydra or two Hydras or flying Hydras as well. Uh, but I, I like this one uh, just because you're able to get three out of them. Um, for my armor, we have um, plus two in uh, the Dark Hydra skill and we have uh, plus one in the Fateful Thrall, 
which is why I'm able to uh, overcap the actual skill tree. And we have some uh, companion critical hit chance here as well. Basically the gear I'm using and uh, I'm going to show some gameplay right now.